how, what are the factors that you would need to take into consideration about a country or an economy to determine the, the ideal inflation? And I'll, I'll preface that by saying that most economists, I would say, feel that some inflation is a positive influence on the economy, like one to 3%, and that most people recognize extreme uh, deflation or inflation is, is terrible and, and can be really detrimental. But w what are the factors that play into like w why inflation is good and how to think about it? So, I mean, ultimately inflation is the amount, uh, well, the increase in price in a society and a large portion of that is driven by the increased amount of capital available in a specific society, right? And, and it also plays out not only that against supply and demand, right? So the more supply in the market, then the, then the, the, and the demand stays the same, then ultimately, you know, the price drops and vice versa, right? The more demand, the less supply, the, the prices rise significantly. And that then is accounted as inflation. Yeah. And, and from an economic standpoint, that's simple terms of where we're at. Why is a standard amount of inflation good? I think it just shows that there's a bit, you know, there's the demand is growing and exceeds the actual supply, which means that the wealth in a society is actually growing. People feel that there's more money out there. People want to buy. So the demand is slightly, always slightly stronger than the supply. That's what you ideally want, because that means that we can produce more. The economy is healthy. There is always demand there for what we produce. We can still innovate. And there is, again, more demand to be able to meet that new market fit with a new product, with new pricing, with, or it puts pressure to optimize from a manufacturing standpoint, how do I deliver more product to market? So I can hire more people to help, you know, with the factories and, and, and et cetera, to produce more goods, to then have those delivered and put into the shelves or into warehouses where people can then go and purchase that.